Today, Heather Luke pleaded no contest to two felonies for a deadly wrong way crash last summer. New at 6, 24 News 8's Danny Carlson spoke with the victim's family who says the court system let them down. Heather Luke pled no contest to driving while intoxicated, causing William Foster's death and manslaughter with a motor vehicle. The two felonies mean she could face up to 30 years in prison, but they also mean she won't face a second degree murder charge. Foster's family tells us they see today and the fact that she has yet to serve one day in jail as just another step in a court process that doesn't guarantee justice for their loved one. The lady went the wrong way drunk on a highway and killed somebody and a thousand dollar bail 10 percent is utterly unheard of that was almost like a slap in our family's face william foster's family is angry but even more they say they're hurt and we came to the conclusion that more than likely there's not going to be justice for william they tell us they've been unhappy with the courts every step of the way. Heather Luke was badly injured in last summer's fiery wrong way crash. Her family has told us she suffered brain damage. And you can see nine months later, she still walks with a limp. But for Foster's family, their loved one, a father, grandfather, a role model, he's gone and Luke is free on bond. The man didn't deserve to die. And the lady didn't deserve to walk. She's free to drive another vehicle, free to go to a bar, <laughs> maybe do it again. Heather Luke is scheduled to be sentenced June 1st.